Light is a type of electromagnetic radiation which travels about 300,000 kilometers or 186,000 miles per second in a vacuum. As well as visible light, radio waves, microwaves, infrared, ultraviolet X-rays and gamma rays are types of electromagnetic radiation. All of these travel at the speed of light, which is an ultimate barrier. Or is it? In order to understand why the speed of light is about 300,000 km per second in a vacuum, we need to clearly understand what a vacuum or free space is. We generally suppose, apart from material objects such as planets, stars and asteroids, that space is empty, but that's not strictly true. So-called empty space contains gas, dust, charged particles, light from stars, cosmic rays, radiation left over from the Big Bang, neutrinos from nuclear reactions, and gravitational, electric and magnetic fields. Empty space is also filled with dark energy and dark matter, which we can't directly detect. Even if we could remove all of these components, space would still have vacuum energy, the Higgs field, and its internal shape or curvature, which can't be taken out. So empty space is not nearly as empty as we usually think. Among the properties to which the unseen components of empty space give rise are vacuum permittivity and vacuum permeability. In physics, vacuum permittivity can be thought of as resistance to the formation of electric fields, whereas vacuum permeability can be thought as resistance to the formation of magnetic fields. So by its very nature, our universe sets limits on the speed of interactions between magnetic and electric fields. Since electromagnetic radiation consists of electric and magnetic fields, the universe also limits the speed of electromagnetic radiation, in other words, the speed of light. We can measure the values of vacuum permittivity and vacuum permeability experimentally. In 1864, Scottish scientist James Clerk Maxwell combined laws found by Faraday, Ampere, Lenz and Gauss. And found the value of the speed of light. So as you can see, the speed of light depends on vacuum permittivity and vacuum permeability. Why is the speed of light about 300,000 kilometers or 186,000 miles per second in a vacuum or in free space? Now we know the answer. The structure of space limits the speed of interactions between magnetic and electric fields, and these interactions in turn place a limit on the speed of light. If we were in a different universe in which the vacuum permittivity and vacuum permeability were different, then the speed of light would also be different. Mm -hmm.